YouTube, Wanger375 here again for LPX Reviews. Uh, just taking a quick break from me editing the uh, one week review of the Samsung Galaxy Gear S. Um, it's taking me a little bit longer than I hoped, but I thought I'd address uh, a few, uh, well, address the main question I've been getting, ironically, from some of you actually, uh, sending me private messages and also through my Facebook page. So, um, and that is, is the Gear S waterproof? Um, I, you guys can probably go online and search right now. There's been other tests through the other gears, the Gear 2, Gear 2 Neos, and Gear Fits, and people have done the water cup tests on them. And yes, they are waterproof. Um, actually, even my own Gear Fit, I actually took the leap of faith and went to a water park and went swimming with it, went diving and on the water slides, and it worked just fine throughout the entire day. Still worked. The chlorine kind of discolored the band a little bit, but it worked nonetheless. Now, do I recommend you? wearing it while swimming and going outside? No, um, it wasn't designed to be worked on the water, but it just kind of showed the extremes of it, that what it could last. Now, the product category actually, especially for this device, um, it does say that it doesn't recommend you being underwater for more than 30 minutes on it. So I think there is a limit to these, but they are water resistant. But to prove to you, the community, I'm going to risk my own watch that I did not buy the replacement plan for. Um, through Best Buy, I still haven't done so. Uh, I'm gonna put it in a cup of water. Um, why am I risking it? Because, well, um, first and foremost, besides being trying to be an informative channel, I'm trying to be entertaining. So if this fails, then my misery will be your laughter. Uh, if it succeeds, then I hope it answers your question. So uh, without further ado, here we go. And this time it's not gonna be some prepared water. I'm gonna fill a fresh cup. So just say, I'm not, I'm not going to be using fake water. It's real water I'm using for the faucet. Here we go. And just a quick shout out, I'm doing the selfie video from my Note 4 right now. So it's not too bad, I hope. We'll find out. All right, that should be enough water, I think. All right. Here, legit water. Now what we're going to do is show that it's still running. We're going to put it on. Go on here. We're gonna go to the stopwatch. That's why I've seen the other YouTubers do, so I think that's why I'll do the same thing here. Um, where's the stopwatch? Ah, here we go. Here we go, just to see, see it. I'm gonna start the time. It's going. <laughs> here we go. Um, I'm just gonna put it right in front of it. <laughs> I hate this. I really hate this. And we're just going to drop it right in. Oh, it still works! <laughs> Folks, it is literally in the water. I am not joking you. It's in there. Now, your Note 4 device is not waterproof, so do not water test it. Um, but look, it is still going. Pretty strong. Let me just I'm gonna swirl it around in there. My fingers look fat. Look, I'm going to swirl it around in there. Spin it around, and it is still going. Actually, let me see if I can use it underwater. Press the home button. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, I'm spilling all over right now. All right, one thing you'll notice. Yeah, I'm gonna take it right, I'm gonna take it out now. All right, one thing you'll notice when you are using it in water, um, the water actually messes with the touchscreen. It actually makes it react sometimes. Um, I noticed it when I was in the pool and I took a shower with it by accident. But um, as you see here, turn it on and it still works just fine. Actually here, let me play you a song just to tell you what I think about this song, what, a, what I think about this watch here. Sorry, let me repeat that again. All right, I know that was cheesy, but um, hopefully, I hope that this answered your question um, uh, to some of you who asked me, and it is waterproof. So another check mark for the Gear S and Samsung. Um, they are not paying me for this, by the way. This is just completely me trying to become up and coming here, but... Um, I hope, I hope that this proved enough to you guys that this is an awesome watch. 
Um, the fact that it's waterproof, so you don't have to worry about the rain or someone pushes you into, in, into the pool, it's still gonna work just fine. All right, so, so I hope you enjoyed this little demo. Um, Please look out for my. Uh, please look out for the video either coming out tomorrow or the day after of my actual one week review of the Gear S, um, and it's a solid review because what I did was I purposely left my Note 4 in my phone home all day and just used the watch for seven days straight. Um, so for my emails, my calls, my notifications, my text messaging, I just solely used the Gear S for one week. Um, I won't tell you anything about it now. That's for the next video, uh, but. Look out for that, and like always, please, um, if you liked or disliked this video, please hit that little thumb button below. Also, if you want to leave any positive or negative comments or any feedback in general of what you would like to see or if any questions about the device, I'd be more than happy, more than happy to answer all your questions. Um, so for those of you who have already liked, um, liked all of my previous videos and watched them, thank you for your support. It is, this is awesome. I'm enjoying every bit of this right now, so, um, but once again, Waterproof, one more time. I'm just gonna drop it in there. Now I'm cold. I'm pretty confident about it now. But uh, this is Wanger375 for LPX Reviews. Signing out. Bye bye.